Hey guys. Okay, so I just got done eating that terrible unhealthy breakfast. But yeah, uh, that's a glass of water. Mm. You know, you got to drink a bunch of these a day to stay hydrated. It's so crazy what this camera picks up. The glass is literally on the other side, but I guess it's like a wide angle lens. I don't know, it's my phone camera, but whatever. So yeah, today we're gonna try out the Fenty foundation. Um, and I'm gonna try it out with the primer. So I just have two samples. This is the color 390. It didn't look good in the store, so I did not buy it. It looked terrible on me, but I'm gonna try it out for the day. And then I bought the matchsticks. Um, like I said in my other videos, suede is pretty close to like my actual color of my skin. It's just a little bit lighter, but I love it because it's got this like neutral undertone going on and I just love it. Um, and of course, we have that. So yeah, I have the, the um, I have a sample uh, primer on. I have on this because I always wear this because I've been, my hair was wet and now it's not. I was doing a treatment on it. So yeah, anyway, let's get started. Here's the brush that I'm gonna use. I have this little brush from um, from Morphe. I have never used it before. Or I could use this brush from Real Techniques. I don't know, whatever. And then I I'm gonna set it with the All Nighter makeup spray. Uh, her line didn't come out with the spray yet, so. I'm just gonna use this to set it. I've never used a spray, so yeah. Right now I'm just gonna go in with the primer, the Photo Blur primer. Y'all know at Sephora they are stingy with um, with the samples. <laughs> a little bit stingy, that's okay. I would much rather have a good like if I was a company I would much rather sell like a sample instead of just like selling it to people because I don't want you to return it used so I don't know why they're always so stingy with samples but whatever I don't know why okay that's all blended in I know some people are like weird about using your hands but I use my hands for this um, I know a lot of girls that they use a brush for theirs, but it's like, whatever. Now I got the foundation. I did my own sample because they were being so lazy at the store. So, yeah. Let me see. I don't know which one is, like, better lighting. Whatever. Anyway, this lighting is just terrible, but this is a vlog, so who fucking cares? I'm gonna, me and Ismael actually, um... Me and him, we're going out to IHOP later on, so that's why um, I'm doing my makeup right now. Me and him are going to get pancakes. I know, I know. I already had fucking Denny's for breakfast. What's wrong with me? Well, I'm bored. That's what's wrong with me. So, yeah, I mean, the color is a little bit, like, dark for me personally and it's a little bit orange but we're gonna try to make this work y'all oh this brush is so like soft and you gotta do it quick because i know i'm ashy this makeup sets really quickly so There we go. I got this mirror right here so I can like. Oh wow, I love this brush. So far. It has like a thousand, has thousands of bristles. So like, it's there's no streakiness, none of that. Like this shit gets everything. Okay, uh, it's not really getting that mold, that's weird. I'll just have to go over it again, I'll try it again. Oh, whoops. Oh, shit. 
I knew I felt something wet on me. Oh my gosh, it's all over my hand. I'm such an idiot, y'all. What is wrong with me? <laughs> I love myself. You know what? I'm just going to have to just do like that and just dot it with whatever's left over. I'm going to set that there and I'll be back because y'all I'm so like I'm such a dit sometimes when it comes to things like I was complete and this stuff stains so I was completely like not paying attention. Okay let's see if I can cover some of this. Seems like it's not like covering it. I don't know. I'm not doing it right. It's just foundation. How hard could it be? It's like it's just kind of like moving around. I don't know. Okay, guys. I'll be back. Of course, I'm breaking out. It's that time of month. So, I have this. I know this is like for your powder or whatever. Or maybe I shouldn't use this. Let's see. I don't even think I need setting spray, but I'll try it out and see. Okay, this is a highlighter stick. It did not get like a lot of the parts that I really wanted it to get. So like the whole color, this color, like the foundation is like super orange looking. So um, I don't conceal a lot like, so I only do about that much. And I think I'm good here. It's just really, really dry. Like that is the one thing I don't like. It's super dry. Like, ugh. Okay, that's good. That's actually a lot. I use it on conceal that much under my eyes. And yeah. Okay, then we got this. I'll do a little bit today. Yeah, it's just like super dry. Oof, that's annoying. Nobody likes like a super just like dry product like that. Think should I do a little bit under? Uh, <laughs> under there. Okay. I'll even it out. This is my Bobbi Brown stick, and this is my Fenty stick that I use for contouring. So, uh. Yeah, you get more, and I think the Bobbi Brown stick is a little bit more chubbier, but the Bobbi Brown stick is like 40 bucks, and this one is 25 so, I mean, it's basically equal because, let's say you bought two of these, it would be $50, so it would be pretty equal because it would be like a little bit less. You see what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's, they're both equal. I may use a little bit of this one today because this one is creamy and it's easy to spread. I just like it a lot. Not that I don't really like these. It's just it's like I would prefer not to use these. These were three for $52, which is not that bad because they were like $18 a piece. And this could be a foundation stick for you. Okay, let's see. I'm just going to take this brush. And just kind of like blend it out. Oh, you know what? I'm so dumb. You know, let me do the under eye first. You know what? The under eye is so goddamn dry that like... I'm just going to spread this with my finger. Like, it's so dry. <laughs> yeah. Oh. And my hand is kind of warm. So maybe like the warmth of my hand can like bring it on in. Because like, oof, that is not... That is dry as fuck. Okay. It's so dry that like it's honestly like not even blending. I need to spray a little bit on there. Okay, let's see. This will blend out. Okay, it's blending a little bit, but oof. You gotta really like get in there. And I know I probably like let it sit too long, but it's also picking up like a lot of the product. Which is cool because you don't want like all that product on your face. And I already have a uh, high cheekbone, so I really don't, I don't want that like 
like super deep look. So I really have to blend mine out. And I bring mine upward instead of downward. Oof, my hand is hurting from all this damn blending. <sighs> Have you guys ever seen somebody? What is that? That was weird. It looked like I had something on my hand. See, it looks like I had something on my hand for a second. What is that? Oh, okay. Like, I like my stuff to be so blended that like, you can barely tell that I have like any on. Ugh, tired of it. That's a lot. Oh boy, here we go. You know what? There you go. Uh, my period's about to start, so of course, here comes the acne. Okay, some more blending here. Trying to get it before it dries down too much. Oof. I'm honestly thinking about taking these back because not only is like, I don't know. And I feel like they're just like cute to have, but would I repurchase it? No, like, and that's just being honest until the formula gets a little bit better because it's like, it's, I don't know, it's just like, okay. See if I can fix this. Like in the, the iPhone camera is extremely forgiving, but like this thing, like, it's a little bit different. <laughs> A little different. Okay. Fix it. Thank God for these phone cameras. Like, there we go. Okay. Then here is cinnamon. I already have. Okay, I have this Anastasia Brown brow pencil and soft brow. I mean, a soft brown. Oh, this is gonna take forever. I haven't like arched my eyebrows lately because I've just been a little bit lazy and I like to kind of like get it all done at once. I do it myself because I don't really, that's not why I still even have brows. <laughs> oh my gosh, everybody who I know that like was constantly arching their eyebrows and going to brow people like, a lot of them don't have brows anymore, and I don't know what that's about. I feel like if you're going to a professional, like, you should still have them. <laughs> you know? Like, I feel like, personally, brows are something that you should just learn how to do. Like, you should go get it done once, just so that you can get it to shape, and maybe, like, once a year, just go get it, like, you know, get it shaped to your liking. And then after that, you really got to just learn <laughs> how to do them because what if your brow lady leaves? Like, you're not going to really know what to do. Uh, and I'm doing it in the iPhone camera, guys. So I don't know what I'm thinking right now. I'm going to use. And you know what? This one, this color, honestly, is probably like not even dark enough. Let's see. There you go. You know what? I honestly don't spend that much time on my brows anyway. But the cool thing about it is that like what the? Oh, I got foundation on my nail somehow. The cool thing about foundation is that like just doing it literally like changes your life. Doing um, 
your brows just changes your life. Then I'm gonna do this. Get the one pump. It's a brand new bottle. Okay. There's a the setting spray. I'm gonna let that set. I don't even think this even needs setting spray, but the concealer could use some. Okay, so this is it in natural lighting. You guys see the color? Like, it's a little bit orange for my taste. And hold on, it's like wet and. Okay, it's still wet and it's still drying down, but do you guys see the color? Like, the color is a little orange. For my taste, like I'm I'm more neutral and this one's just like warm red. Like it no, it's more of like a golden orange tone. I'm not really crazy about how that blended out, but whatever. It's like mm, it's and I know I got my forehead good. Ooh, that's so annoying when makeup artists don't get their forehead very well. I'm gonna go back and fix that. That's annoying. <laughs> forehead, that's much better. All right, let the day start, yay. Okay, I just got a call, that was weird. Anyway, I just made it back from the mailbox and I had a package, Um, well, the leasing office, whatever. So yeah, I had ordered these liquid lipsticks off of Sephora. So um, they were having a sale, so I got a bunch of these. I'm pretty sure everybody got a bunch of these, but I just looked at what I ordered. And surprisingly, I didn't buy multiples of the same color. Like, usually, I'll buy, like, two or three of the same color, and I didn't. But that's okay. I'm just like, okay, I already have owned Rico. I just needed a refill of this. And I've already owned Fiery. So, I got another one of these. I love these. So, oops. okay, my mom just called me. She always calls me whenever I'm just, like doing something and I'm just not in the mood to talk to a person like I don't feel like having anybody talking back to me not in that way just like I don't want to talk back right now I'm not in the mood so yeah this one is fiery I love this one so much it's really pretty it's so cute I have to do like a swatch for you guys but yeah this one is bomb I think I have it in a different version it had like a black top instead of this so there's that one. This one is Baca. Uh, Fiery is a true blue toned, uh, blue under blue undertoned red, and I just love that. This one is more of like a raspberry, like a nice purple raspberry, but more raspberry. This one is Baso. This one is a lighter. This is more of like a orange red, um, but it's beautiful, like. Just love it. I don't know if it makes a difference of me taking it out of the tube or not, but ooh. And you know that formula is no joke with Stila. This is just a really good deal. Then I got Note. Um, okay, this one is more of like a brown purple. Um, it's really cute though. I mean, usually, I don't know, in the tube, it looks brown, purple, but this one's more of just like a dark, like, a dark red, but it's not a red. It's definitely a purple. And then I got Rico, which I thought I already had this one, but I actually don't, I don't think, maybe I haven't ever owned this one. No, I have owned Rico. Yep, this is the one I had before, so I just bought another one of that one, so yeah. I got four colors, and I'm honestly, like, really happy with these. Ooh, I'm really, really happy with these. They're beautiful. Oh, and I like how they're, like, different versions of the same color. So, that's going in my... So, yeah. So, yeah, that's just going in the makeup stash. Okay, then I have the Lip Injection Glossy. This came as a sample. That's one thing I love whenever you order from like Sephora. You always get a sample glossy. Hopefully I can share it out and it won't look, you know, super white on me. This one's called Milkshake. That's the color, of course. Anyway, um, I love lip injection type of like lip 
plumpers because they really help with the fine lines and especially people with big lips we always have fine lines then i got like a few samples i got prada carbon i'm not really crazy about prada scents really i, I do oh, i'm not even like that crazy about prada candy but i don't know it smells okay um let's see if this is a male scent or not a male scent right yeah that one is considered a male scent. I'm not even sure why. I think they just gave me any type of sample, honestly. And then I got Versace. Wow. That one really smells like a douchebag. Let me see. Hmm. This one is a nice, sweet smell. It's cool. I like it. And I'm not even sure what this is. Glow Activating Anti-Wrinkle Serum. So... That right there is something that I would put on before bed. So anyway, I'm gonna go throw these boxes away and finish off the day. Oh, just I just wanted to show you guys what I just bought and then I'm gonna go call my mom back. <laughs> Putting on eyeshadow, I usually never do, but I got this Juvia's Place palette. Oh, my stomach is acting weird. I don't know if my period's about to start. My period is late though. No, I'm not pregnant. I took a test. <laughs> Um, yeah, but I knew it was going to be late because I started my birth control late this month because of all the bull crap I was going on being like sick and stuff. So I knew it was going to like not be that be kind of off this month. This this thing is cool. The only issue is that like the dark is they don't have like dark ones that I like for my skin like like online everything looked so much darker and it's not like super pigmented either like mm -mm. this like my nyx ones those are pigmented as fuck this is kind of just like i mean you gotta put like a lot of product on to get it and even when i did like a finger swatch like like let me see like see, like, see, I just swatched it, and this is the darkest one. There's another swatch. The pink one swatched pretty good, but this is the one that I'm currently, like, putting on my lid right now. Let me try to put some pink on there. It's just, like, not coming out good. It's like, I don't know. I could do without it. Mm. yeah i'm just not a fan of this i'm glad i bought the mini instead of the big one i'm really glad that i didn't buy the big one this is what the mini looks like which i think is big enough see and it was only 15 bucks and it's like i mean that makes sense i think usually it's like 25 or something because you get like 16 colors for $15 and then the shipping was like five bucks. So it was almost $20. I don't know. That kind of makes sense why it's not so great. But I feel like it should be like sold in like, I feel like it should be sold in like CVS or something. I don't know. I don't think it's really, I don't think it's that great. <laughs> yeah. And CVS would be a really good deal. But like, yeah, it's just like, it's just kind of like melting in and it's like, it's whatever anyway hey guys we're headed to sephora now um i think that the under eye stick blended it out better i was just telling her <laughs> um and, <laughs> and then i said it with all nighter spray oh you know what i use that juvia's place palette have you used that before uh, i've never heard they got bad customer service i don't support that type of shit but and it's very it's like not pigmented like i put it on my lids today and i had to put so much just to look like this i was like no wonder it's so like yeah yeah it's just kind of like but i got the mini one i didn't get the full one the full one was like they were on sale they were ten dollars off i think so it was fifteen dollars so i just got that it's yeah but the full one has a way bigger pan but i, I don't even use makeup enough to do that Oh, are we, are we oh yeah, 
Okay, we're gonna t take the um, 360 exit. Hey guys, we're at Sephora. I'm gonna, I have a piece of paper that I wrote down the colors for myself. And I got chestnut and the Sephora stick. So I'm gonna try that one out, whoops. Hey guys, we just left Sephora. I look cakey under here because of that damn stick foundation, <laughs> double stick. Anyway, I ended up picking up, um, we're trying on shoes. I'm looking at shoes on sale. <laughs> definitely a sale but they don't have anything of course in my size that's on sale but they have some really cute shoes here um yeah so i ended up picking up this foundation brush it's the number 70. they haven't even come out with it yet it's expensive mm -hmm. then i got this foundation stick in chestnut 12 so it matched me very well so that's because the winter's coming up and then i bought these with me just in case So I picked up one pair of shoes that, um, the, I don't know, they look like this. They're just some flip flops or whatever. So, I'm gonna go check out. I don't need nothing else in here. Hey guys, so, right now we're just eating. Um, I went to three different places. She went to one. Um, I got the frozen lemonade from Chick-fil-A. Um, it's like sweet and tangy. It's actually not that bad pretty good and then I got this wonton from one place and then I got um, some Panda Express I don't ever eat there but I was like fuck it let me just try it so I ended up getting this and they're pretty generous surprisingly so yeah we're going to eat and then finish up we're probably gonna go back to Sephora and just walk around a little bit mm -hmm. mm, the noodles are really good I'm gonna put a little sauce on here though.